we are located pretty much in the Cascade Range. The Mount Hood is over there, Mount Adams is back there, and so we're pretty much in the middle of the Cascade Range. I'm Jennifer Ewer and our orchard is called Valley Crest Orchards. We're in the Hood River Valley at the south end near the town of Parkdale. The high point on our orchard is about 2,200 feet elevation, which is one of the highest places where the pears are grown in Hood River. This is just right. It's kind of like Goldilocks. It's not too warm and it's not too cold and it's not too wet and it's not too dry. It's too dry over there, it's too wet over there. It's too warm to the south. And we grow green anjos, red anjos, green bartlets and red bartlets, star crimsons, camis, bosque, and seckles. I'm 49. When I was a kid, I always worked on the orchard and when I came back from college. I was I worked for a while after college and I've been farming for about 25 years. My grandfather came out from Pennsylvania in about 1912 and started with the area of our orchard where our shop now is. My grandfather also planted green anjo pears, green bartlett pears, and some bosque pears. And so we still have a couple of the apple trees that he planted and a couple of blocks of the original green anjo, green bartlett blocks. And we still farm those and they're still productive. We actually are standing in an orchard that we developed when I decided to come back and farm. These trees in this block, when we first planted them, I got to do a lot of the pruning and spreading. We, we put spreaders in the trees and opened them up and trained them to be this shape. Pruning is a terribly important thing in what we do, and that's what we do in the wintertime. And the pruning is one of the things that makes us sustainable. We prune in a sustainable manner. You cycle people through pruning, and you cycle them through thinning, and you cycle them through picking, and we cycle them through all the different varieties that we grow. And so we can have a smaller group of people who are more, um, who are gonna be more permanent and be employed more of the year. So we have a lot of the same people that have been working for us for 30 years, and some of their kids are working for us. And we're the same family that's always been here. I really enjoy working with the people that we work with. We have a wonderful crew. One of the biggest challenges to pear farming in the Hood River Valley is development. Populations are where high value farmland is because originally people settled more densely in places where the land was more productive. So most metropolitan areas are close to the most valuable high value farmland that can produce the most valuable crops. This little valley that's like 18 miles long or 20 miles long, and it's one of the premier places in the world to grow pears. It's very finite. My hope is that people will begin to realize that their vitamins and their nutrients and their all the things that we're told to eat more of are all coming from these places that are closer and at more risk. Everything that we do in our orchard, we try to do in a long-term sustainable manner because we've been here for close to 100 years and it'd be nice to think that we could continue to do the same thing on the same piece of land. We're always thinking about the most efficient, simple, safe way to grow our fruit. I enjoy being outside. I love to watch things grow. And there's something new to do every day. Every season is different. There's never two days that are the same. Sometimes I wish two days would happen alike in a row. That would be, that would be good. <laughs> It's intrinsically rewarding to be producing something that you know is good for people. There's nothing about what I produce that's bad for people. Pears are just, they're good for you. It's a product that's, there's nothing bad about it, it's all good. It's just all good, it's good for you and more of it is better. I mean, there's a lot of things where more isn't necessarily better, but if you eat more pears, it really is better. Green Bartlett. Green Bartlett. Red Bartlett. Bosk. 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 Red Anjou. 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 Concord. Seckel. Comis. Pharrell. Pharrell. USA Pears. USA Pears. USA Pears. USA Pears. USA Pears. USA Pears. USA pears.